Hey guys, and welcome to the Tarbash Replay Showcase with me, Jack Morris from Manifair Films. Well, this week, once again, we are starting on the admin's choice because I felt like that worked quite well last week, so we're probably going to be doing that for the foreseeable future. This is Saronix's pick, M Spice Spice Baby, da 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 by Master Tor 3. Master to Zero 3. Master Tori, obviously. Ah, okay. Uh, this is, uh, uh, well, I mean, I just saw it, but I haven't actually watched it, as with all the admin's choice. This looks like um, something of a one-shot, maybe, I guess it's technically a two-hit, so literally right out of the gate, this isn't a one-shot, but it, it kind of it has that same appeal, you know, of just one one very, very cool thing happening as opposed to a bunch of things going on. I need, I need to, like, I don't know, write the Jack, Jackisms dictionary to try to figure out what these actually, like, I change the meaning of a one-shot, like, every single week, but I guess it is one hit, so this isn't a one-shot, but it's one motion. It's it's a one thing. It's a one thing, <laughs> you know. I, it's cool, though. I like the um the sort of shocking amount of destruction that comes from those kind of simple kicks you know we got the uh kicks off both of jeff's legs and then uppercuts to get the decap we'll uh let the frames run out and then slow this down to try and actually get a better idea of what's going on here so if i uh angle the camera here you should be able to see the um the very maybe from behind would actually look better for this uh coming in here you can see the leg coming around no it comes that side damn it actually kind of goes uh Kind of goes in between. Let's look at that again. It looks like he, like, kicks maybe, like, there and kicks off both of the, uh... Not sure why I said that, so, like, there. That's where he kicks. He kicks there. And manages to get, uh, both of the legs off, which is really, really cool. And I actually missed what happened with the, um, with the head there, so... Uh, oh, it's the kick. It's a, it's very straightforward. It's the kick that kind of kicks off. Yeah. As, as kicks generally tend to do, it's the kick that kicks off the rest of the body. Actually, kicks don't generally kick off body parts, but, I mean, they do on this show, but I'm, I'm talking about real life. I mean, I, I've kicked, I've kicked my fair share of things, and they haven't dismembered into a million pieces most of the time. It's cool replay, though. Definitely worthy of, uh, admin's choice if I do say, so we'll go through, uh, one more time. Yeah, in case you can't tell, I'm all about the reverse motion today. Don't know what it is. It's in my blood today. Anyway, moving along. Up, oh, this is white screen. Uh, moving along. This is ground. Wait, have I already done one? Hang on. Let me just go back. There we are. Okay, this is, um, at least fix that. This is Graham Boom Shackalaka. This is a musical episode. All the replays are named after songs, and I'm saying that without remembering the name of any other replay on this show. So this is a this is a blind prediction. This is Graham Boom Shackalaka by Gramophone or Gramophazerone, however you want to say it. This is another two shot. Actually, this is another two shot. I. Uh, Kind of coincidence with the uh, admin strokes. Obviously, I didn't pick that. So uh, this is this is also really really cool though. Because I, I think we're opening with a dick kick there. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. There's no doubt about that. That was right in his dick. Yeah, Jeff's not enjoying that. Jeff is a, Jeff is going to be a negative Nancy after that one. All right, I was going to say a sour puss, but that felt like it. <laughs> that felt like bad taste to say that sentence after getting kicked in the dick. Okay. Um. Let's see if we can get a. A real good zoom. Look at that dick. Look at that penis. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> he, like, <laughs> Gramophone, like, put his hand over our eyes. Like, he didn't want us to see it. All right, well, fuck you. I have mastery of the camera. I can do anything. That's the hand covering the... Oh, it's a heel kick, too. Oh, you know there was no spongy on that. That was, like, all bone. That was all bone hitting the bone there. That's... Oh, god, that's not good. Let's, uh, actually look at the rest of the replay. I was too distracted by the cringing pain. Uh, whence my loins. Ha! Kind of like a uppercut stab into the neck there to get the decap as well. I keep saying the word uppercut today. It's my word of the day. It was actually on my word of the day calendar. It's cool. It's very cool. Very cool. Let's watch it. Uh, go back to normal. Nope. We'll go back to 40%. Back to normal speed. The decap is very quick as well. You know, a lot happens in the uh, span of the replays. It's a replay, rather. It's very, very cool. Anyway, moving along. This is... Okay. This is a uh, Hakson. Hakson. Ha is, that a, is that just a cute way of saying Hakson? I think it might be. How does he do it? Uh, he, do, he does the do... Uh, Hakeson. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Hakeson because it has an I in it. Hey, Hakeson. 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 I'm not sure. Uh, this is a uh, basketball uh, replay. Now, this is uh, one that I think probably was submitted for replay challenge originally, or like uh, it was definitely submitted for showcase, obviously. But like, I think this was like submitted on behalf of the challenge. Like, this was submitted late, so we're getting it now, and I'm gutted because it's probably the best one we got. It's fucking awesome. How does he do it? How? Does he do it? I don't know. Jeff clearly <laughs> faints from how awesome this replay is. I mean, look at it. Oh, yeah, the frame rate's fucked. I should probably say that. When we did the replay challenge on this mod, I had to come on now. I had to knock it down to 30 FPS just to get it to run. So, yeah, the replay is actually running a bit slow. This isn't, you know, uh, this isn't your computer fucking up. Don't worry. This is actually running at half speed now because of the... Oh, just slightly above half speed. Maybe I should um, 
Maybe I should just make it like a little bit. Let's see if I can get it to 60 FPS by slowing it down. Is that going to work? No, it's j- it actually is the game running at uh, that low FPS. I guess because there's so many, like, models. Like, I hate to say it, but I think this mod would run a lot, lot better if they just removed this out-of-box thing. Like, maybe make it invisible. I'm not sure that actually affects things. It probably doesn't. No, don't make it invisible. Just get rid of it. If you lose the ball, you have to restart the mod. Don't bounce it off the walls. Yeah, because there's, there's so many models on the screen, it's uh, kind of taxing on the old, uh, the old processor. So, yeah, slower replay. But, nonetheless, very, very cool. Despite the low frame rate, you can still tell just how good this one is. And it is really, really, really good. I'm especially fond of the kick he does at the end, you know? I think it's coming up here. Uh, Yeah, there we go. Dunk and go! Basket hoop! Hoop! (laughs) All right, one more time. One more time. It takes a while to get through it, though, because of the frame rate, which is kind of a pain. In fact, can we go, like, can we increment it up? Like, can I I go, like, 10% faster rather than, like, double speed? Fuck it. All right. And uh, anyway, I just kind of want to see the kick. Let's see. Let's get hoop cam going on. Hang on. Let me just get into position before the ball. And there. This awful camera angle, but I don't have time to fix it now. And God forbid going backwards. All right. There we go. That was the worst camera angle ever. Moving along. This is Blade. Ah, Blade MK Full Moon. First kick by Jesse by MK Blade. 299. Okay, so the first kick of this replay is by JC, and the rest is by MK Blade 299. So credit to both of them for the, this replay. But I will say, I think MK Blade definitely did justice. The second half of this replay is really, really good too, although that opening kick is something special. I'm quite fond of that, like Naruto run, uh, Naruto pose right there, just kind of like arms in the air. He should be running, that would be even cooler, but he's not. This is cool. Obviously, the opening kick by Jesse is awesome, but I do think the follow-up is worthy of that kick, you know? I think it adds quite a lot to the replay. It, it's, uh, it's pretty awesome. It is pretty, pretty awesome. And it's pretty, pretty, you know? It looks pretty. I like that word. It's a fun word. I'm in a good mood today, guys. Can you tell? We had some good news earlier, like Man of Fire related, that we'll be able to talk about pretty soon. Good news, good times, happy days. I mean, this is Sunday, so maybe tomorrow, Monday, I'll be miserable, but oh, who, who cares? You guys won't actually see anything I'm recording tomorrow, so it won't matter. Ha, okay. Um this is um this is a cool. This is a this is a cool. This is a cool. One hundred percent a cool. One hundred one hundred and fifty percent a cool, actually. No, no. Hundred percent a cool, fifty percent awesome, maybe twenty-five percent brilliant. Because it's pretty brilliant, but it's not like one hundred percent brilliant. No, I mean I'm not it's good, but it's not that good. Alright, I don't know I don't know what the fuck I'm saying anymore. This is uh this is cool then. Let's watch it one more time and then we'll uh move along to a uh, bit of a Bit of a cameo replay, I guess. We'll, um, I think this is the next one. I've been trying to keep counting my head. Our next replay is... Is ConCon making replays now? By our friend, ConCon19. And if you missed the collab we did with him a couple of weeks ago, probably a month ago or two at this point, go check it out. I'll put a card on the screen now. Go watch it. It was a lot of fun. We played some uh, Terry Bash with ConCon. It was a lot of fun. But this is a replay by him. Is ConCon making replays now? By ConCon. And I guess he is, because it's fucking awesome. I, to answer his own question, I think he is making replays now. That's, uh a butchered bastardization of a quote from John Wick right there. Those who recognized a good job, those who didn't, I'm sorry, I tried to get it right. Is ConCon making replays now? I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah, he is. You should see that movie. It's fucking awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just pause this Tori Bash replay showcase to review John Wick. It's an entire film where Keanu Reeves' dog gets killed, and it's really sad and heartbreaking, one of the more emotional scenes in the movie, and then he spends the rest of the movie killing the entire Russian mafia as revenge. That's the movie, and it's fucking awesome. Go watch it. Anyway, this replay. And that's what I was quoting just now. Just for people who completely missed what I was talking about. Yeah, this is awesome. We, um, this is actually, we had a few replays from uh, Connor on the show uh, ages ago. I'm talking like episode 60 or 70. Uh, but it's nice to see him come back. And, uh, you know, true to form, they're really, really, really cool. Uh, especially fond of that end where he kind of spikes the head into the ground to chip off what's left of the neck. You know, we'll, uh, we'll slow this from- Oh, God! Ah! I keep doing that. Okay. Can you guys tell what's happening? Hang on, let's, I, I always forget how fast we can go with this. It's been a while. It's been a while. You know, this is, uh, this is a real good representation of the replay right here. This is, um, obviously you guys can tell every single thing that's happening. And my favorite part is just watching, like, that body part. Like, whoop, 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 whoop. It's cool. All right, let's stop being silly now. I don't want to go backwards. I just want to... There we go. Okay. So, right, we have a kick to the uh, left arm to kick it off. Uh, grab to grab off the other, punches off the other arm, I guess, and grabs after it. And sort of downward kick to the leg. I will find a better angle in a sec, guys. Uh, it's a knee to the sort of upper body that gets the neck stump out. Grabs it, holds it up into the air, and then I believe he's just going to spike it down here. But I have no idea what side, so forgive the pen. And dunk. Very, very nice. Very nice. 
Get, get on, get on, Khan. If you have, if you have no idea who this guy is, uh, you're missing out. Go watch his videos. Uh, I'll put a link in the description to this guy's YouTube channel. Also, again, actually, I post a link to the collaboration we did because that also has a link to his channel in it, and those videos are really fun, and people should watch them. So go watch it. Anyway, moving along, this is our last reaper for today. This is Nightshade. King Kong ain't got shit on me by Nightshade, and this is, um, to my knowledge, not counting the like tricking spas we've had this might be the first time i've put a parkour replay as the final replay because as much as i love parkour it's rare that i'll find a parkour replay that's better than the combat replays but this is fucking awesome this is one of my favorite parkour replays of all time it's not it's not got uh like nice nah, i get a better camera angle actually it's not like the most long technical complicated one but it's just like it's <laughs> it's damn good at what it does and what it does isn't pretty that's wolverine for anybody wondering um, and it's just really, really cool. Really, really fluid. Gets loads done. A bit of a combat roll there. Sort of 360, uh, sort of maybe 480 spin. A uh, bit of a, like, it looks real. You know, it's not, it, it's stiff, some, uh, you know, sort of sometimes, but for the most part, it's fluid. And it actually looks real. Like, I've seen people doing parkour do these sorts of things. Maybe not so much that, because gravity. But, like, the rest of the replay, the, the, the jump, the actual landing of the jump, the combat roll, the sort of, um, I can't remember the name of that vault that he did down there. I used to know all the names of, like, the parkour vault, I guess not parkour, like the gymnastic vaults and stuff. I used to be really into parkour at one point in my life. But I can't remember what that one's called. It had a name. It's not a lazy vault. I can't remember what it is. Okay. Doesn't matter. It's the only one I can remember. Screw it. There's me. <laughs> you know, that was stupid, right? Because I started that sentence trying to show off, like, my knowledge. You know, like, trying to show off my knowledge of, um, my knowledge of parkour. And then I, like, literally had nothing. Nothing to give. But this is really, really, really cool. One of my favorite parkour replays. That's definitely the highlight there. Let's see if we can... I haven't let the damn frames run out. All right. I'll let that do it so we can, um, maybe watch that bit a couple of times. It's uh, it's really, really cool. Definitely uh, worthy of the final replay and one of the better parkour replays I think we've seen. Unless I'm forgetting a time where we did have um, a parkour replay final. Now, I kind of want to just see... Uh, all right, and he's going to climb up there. And, okay. Right. Oh, no, not backwards. I just want to see it in slow-mo. All right. Oh, there we are. That's a, that's a decent angle. Oh, and there'd be, like, some Linkin Park playing in the background normally. You yeah, know, those, like, parkour montage videos. So it'd be, like, you know... I can't, think of, <laughs> I can't think of a single Linkin Park song. All right. Um, I guess... I, no, I, I'm trying to. I can remember words. I used to, another thing I used to be really into at one point in my life. God damn. All right. I want to get like a normal speed angle of that jump as well. The jump is so cool. Here he comes. Whoosh, whoosh, need to be there. Okay. <laughs> and go back up. Sorry, dude. I'll, there we go. We got it. There we are. Whoosh, whoosh. That looks awesome. It's so cool. All right. We'll uh, leave someone playing in the background while I wrap this shit up. Um... Don't, uh, for those who missed, I, I can't remember if we filmed a video since then, but just in case, uh, for those who missed our last Turbash livestream, we announced the winners of uh, the Turbash giveaway we did for our second channel, which is launching soon, and by launching, I mean uh, branding soon, and we'll be able to talk about what it is and what it's called and stuff very, very, very soon, and the channel's launching pretty soon as well. All the winners have claimed their prize, so don't try to scam me. A couple of people did, like, hey, I'm that guy. He's like, can you send an email from the email address that won? Uh, no, I, I, I won, though. It's like, yeah, okay, buddy. Um, the best part was a couple of people tried it after all three prizes had been claimed. That was fun. Uh, but yeah, all prizes have been claimed now. Congratulations to those three people. Uh, it was good. We'll be doing another giveaway fairly, fairly soon to help promote the, uh, the channel once it's actually launched as well. And uh, for those who missed the last Tori Bash live stream and were heartbroken because they missed us being live, we're doing another one. We're doing a Tori Bash live stream this Friday at 8 p.m. GMT. That's the Friday of this week. I'm sorry I can't get the date up. Well, I mean, I can, but I'm trying to vamp until I get my phone calendar up to check what date this is. Hey, you guys should go see John Wick. It's really fucking 8th of May. The 8th of May, 2015 at 8 p.m. GMT. I know we normally start at 7, but we're... Uh, gonna try to bump it an hour or so ahead just to try to make it a little bit easier for our american viewers to catch the stream i mean that extra hour should give a bit of a grace period for them to get home from work and school and stuff to be there in time for the stream if you don't know what time 8 p.m gmt is in your time zone it's very very easy to google it just google 8 p.m gmt in and then your time zone and if you don't know what your time zone is literally google what's my time zone google will tell you it is that smart Anyway, uh, like I said, 8 p.m. GMT, we'll be doing some Tari Bash. Not really sure what we're going to be doing. I'm kind of hoping to do another betting server because it was a lot of fun when we did that last time. But we'll just stick about in Tari Bash, play the game, and vamp and answer questions and all that stuff we love doing. Anyway, I've been Jack Morris, Man of Five Films, and I'll be back next week, hopefully with Cameron, because I want to look at those replays that were sent specifically for Cameron. So yeah, uh, I couldn't get him for this week either. He's, a, he's not a busy dude, he's a lazy dude. Anyway, I'll see you later, guys. Bye.